Okay, here is a power supply update. I got everything soldered together and I got it putting out about 3 volts right now. Um, everything is looking good, nothing's getting overly hot. Arctic Flyer is nice and cool. This is just slightly warm. Um, 3 volts. And if I turn it up a little, whoop, it's turning it down. All the way up to about 16, 17, 18. So actually this is putting out more than I thought it was, so that's kind of cool. Um, the only thing I don't like is it's really, really touchy. Right down at the bottom of the scale. See, I'm barely moving it. And it's just like jumping from like zero to like four or five volts. So I have to really fight to get it down to three like that. Um, I also checked it with the multimeter and this is pretty accurate. So next step is to build it into the case. So I don't know if anybody has any just suggestions on how I can make this so it's less touchy. I'd appreciate it. I mean, once I get it up above five, it, it kind of it slows down. And if I turn it all the way, I can get uh, 10, 11, 12, 13, 16 volts. And yeah, it's pretty darn good. And I wonder if it gets any hotter if I do that. Eh, not really. Nothing's, nothing's heating up to the point where, yeah, nothing's even hardly warm at all, so that's good. So, yeah, there's the power supply so far. Transformer's getting warmer than anything else. So, yeah, that's where we stand right now. Unplug it. I just got a test cord rig to it right now. But I gotta leave for work now, so I don't have time to do any more work on this. But at least I got it all soldered together. You can see my wiring back here. And next step will be to work on the case. Hopefully I can get everything to fit in there. Okay, uh, looks like this will fit in here perfect. This, I'll have to mount like this. And this, this thing isn't gonna stick this far into the case, but I, cause I'm gonna it's going to mount on the outside, so it's going to be like kind of like that. Maybe I can fit this under here. Let's try that. Maybe. Maybe, maybe not. So, I can mount it like this. I have to get some standoffs so it doesn't touch the, the case. And it'll sit right about there. Then I can mount this here, and then this can go right there. It's going to be pretty cramped in there. Then I can drill some ventilation holes in the top, and maybe some in the side. Maybe if it gets a little warm, I'll just I'll put a fan in it somehow, and. So yeah, this this will fit right here nice. I'll put an indicator light right there. So the hardest part is going to be drilling a hole for this. Ow. 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 So yeah, I got to drill a hole for this. Gotta be like that size. And that'll just fit right in there. Oop, I keep putting the camera down. So, yep. I'll work that out another day. And also, I forgot about this. There it is. This, I might not have room for this because 
this is going to stick out and I might, might not might not have room for that. I might just have to use a strain relief device. But that's no big deal. I mean, I don't have to unplug it anyway. Get out of that. She's knocked this box over so many times. All right, anyway, um, that's that's how we are. That's how we stand right now. So definitely have to work on this another day. So see you guys later. Thanks for watching.